I wanna be a billionaire so fucking bad Buy all of the things I never had I wanna be on the cover of Forbes magazine Smiling next to Oprah and the Queen Oh, every time I close my eyes I see my name in shiny lights Yeah, a different city every night Oh, I, I swear The world better prepare For when I'm a billionaire Hi, my name is Sierra Joyner we're here in my current city of Tampa, Florida. I work at the University of Tampa as an assistant director of Residence Life. You might wonder what an assistant director is. Basically, I'm a dorm mother and an apartment manager. I work every day to ensure that students have a safe, comfortable, happy living environment. I really, truly love my job. I'm 29 years old, getting ready to go into 30. The reason I want my own show I want my own talk show because I want to talk to real people. I want to talk to real people about their real problems, their real triumphs, their real successes, and their real hardships. I want others to know that everyone has a story, and everyone's story deserves to be heard. I realized I needed my own show when I was eight years old. It all started in New Jersey. The year is 1989. And you're watching The Sierra Show, The Sierra Show, The Sierra Show. Today on The Sierra Show, we'll be talking to people who have overcome terrible events. Our first guests today are Penelope and Roger. They were in a tragic fire. Penelope, Roger, how are you? Good, good. Excellent. So, tell us a little bit about what happened. It was terrible. There was fire. We got out. We're better now. Wow, I can't wait to hear more about it. We'll be right back after we take this quick commercial break. Remember, you're watching The Sierra Show! The Sierra Show! The Sierra Show! The year is 2000. I'm a sophomore at the University of Tampa in Tampa, Florida. Born and raised in Jersey, I came all the way down here for new experiences. During college, I realized a lot about myself and a lot about people. When friends had problems, I was one of the first people they'd go to. I didn't always know the answers, but I tried to listen. I like to talk a lot, so I don't listen very much. But I would try to listen to them and help them with their problems. I saw them for what they were. Their different experiences, their different problems, their different issues. It wasn't the issues I was having, but it was important to them. That's when I realized that I was meant to talk to people and find out more about people. Because when I find out more about others, I find out more about myself. You're watching The Sierra Show! The Sierra Show! 